Gulten Top Mennonite Moto. It's been a while. Winter's been long. Winter's almost over. I have been riding with the Alpine Star Belize boot last season, which is my first season. And um, the boot did fine. I thought I would try a motocross boot, the Tech 7, this year. And I was really not sure how much better it would be. So we're going to find that out um, later this season. The Belize had no problems. Um, the only thing I was... One of the things I was curious about is the toe box, how high it is. Seems identical to me as far as shifting um, for height. Pretty much the same. Um, and the sizing, I bought a 12 with the Belize and size 12 fits fine with the Tech 7 again. Which is what I buy in all my hiking boots or work boots. So I don't, unless, unless you really prefer a, a smaller size and a super tight fit. I know some guys like that. I used to do that with snowboard boots. When I rode all the time in my younger years, I would have a, a much tighter boot. Um, but now I prefer, it's, it's not the 12 is loose. It's maybe I could fit a half size, but half size smaller. But I wouldn't say that they fit extra big or extra small. They, they seem to be the same as any hiking boot size. Um, I would have to put them on the scale or see what their websites say. Um, definitely a heavier boot. Nothing crazy. I did not... I, I had the bike fall on me plenty of times with my foot stuck underneath this boot. Um, never a problem. Lots of protection. There is plastic on this Belize. Um, I guess being taller with the Tech 7, I'll have even more protection, but the Belize work just fine. Also, the Belize is easy to walk in. Um, the odd time that I did go into the city or had to run into stores, it's easy to walk in this. And being brown leather, um, it looks just fine too. This might be quite a bit more awkward if I ever wanted to do that. I would go back to this if I was hitting the highway for a little while. Only two buckles on the Belize, four on the Tech 7. Um, I find this plastic grip nicer and easier to grab versus uh, this metal one or plastic, whatever this is, aluminum. Um, but they work the same way. More traction on the Belize if you're going to be walking around in mud. Also, I purchased uh, an in the boot style enduro pant. So I'll be wearing that with these boots. I find when I'm riding and coming to a stop, putting my feet down. My over the boot pants with these boots, the, the pant cuffs often catch on things, catch on the pegs, make me fall or almost fall when I come to a stop. Um, I tried to make those over the pant boots tighter, but it's still not ideal. I, I think I'm going to, I don't know, I've, I, haven't, I haven't been using in the boot pants. Maybe I won't like it, maybe more dirt. Or sand will get inside. Um, we'll have to see how I actually like that. Those are the boots. I'm sure you've seen a million videos on YouTube already, but those are my thoughts. It's nice to compare them side by side, seeing the difference in what you're getting. And hopefully in a few weeks I'll be out riding again.